Hello drumming friends, it's Rob here from drumsaword.com bringing you another full song video drum lesson. In this one I want to teach you how to play the drums to the song Sweet Home Alabama by Leonard Skinner, drummed by Bob Burns. And as always you can watch the full version of this lesson by becoming an online member at drumsaword.com. you find a link here or beneath here. So check that out and find out to find out whether that might be something you might be interested in learning hundreds of full song lessons just like this one you're watching now. Take a look at the first bar of the second line, and here's our main drum beat for the entire song. By the way, it's debatable whether he's playing the du -du -du every single time in, in all the verses and choruses because the bass drum is just so hard to hear on the original recording. And um, I, I, I love other people, a lot of other drum teachers, a lot of other people on YouTube, for example, doing drum covers, choose to play the du dum dum throughout the entire song. And if I was playing live with my band as a cover, then I would definitely play du dum dum. Um, every every bar because it just it's distinctive you hear it at the beginning but it is debatable whether it occurs throughout the entire song anyway enough waffling okay so that first bar it's like the same bass drum snare drum pattern but now we're just playing right hand over the top one and two and a three and four and one and two and a three and four so again that tricky part ba boom boom you might want to practice a really simple drum beat to work on that thing where you've got two bass drum notes, what the first note is starting in between the right hand and the second note is landing with the right hand, you could play this pattern just to get, you, get your foot working. One and two and a three and four and a one. So you're playing a three and a one and as a practice bar it's really good to get that technique down. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Then you can start putting the extra bass drum notes in. motion with your foot does take practice and time to get used to so um, you could practice that simple bar um, and then when you come to the song hopefully your technique is up now don't worry if it takes a few months or even a year to make that technique feel comfortable and natural that's something that, that's how long it's going to take it's just nothing else you can do about it you just stick with it and eventually you'll get there with it so don't give up with this when you first try it for the first time if you've been playing drums for a, a few months or a year this is going to seem really difficult at this tempo. If it was slower, no problem. It's all about getting that right hand steady and uh, that, that da dum dum thing, um, which you can work on uh, as an exercise on its own. So then we go on the second bar, 